Welcome to Adobe InDesign CC. In this tutorial, we're going to cover the overview of the workspace in InDesign. So like many uh, Adobe applications, uh, you have your main controls at the very top here, as you can see. And each of these are sort of drop down menus. You can go to the help menu, the windows uh, is basically where everything is located at. So if anything you need to bring out, you can simply click on it and it will pop out over here uh, somewhere on the stage or it will float out in a separate window. Um, on to the left here you have your um, tools and um, right below all these controls here, the main controls, you have all the options to whatever tool you have selected. So when I click on the text tool, you'll see that all the type tool options for character have appeared and then here's all the options for paragraph. So depending on what you have selected, the options will change up here. Over here on the right, uh, you'll see that we are in the Essentials workspace, but you can click in here and there's all these different workspaces. So you can try a different one like typography, for example. Um, you can try out digital publishing. You can see what each one has to offer. So um, depending on what workspace you have, uh, any of these tabs that are sort of over here, can click on it and they'll pop open to the left. If you click on the double arrow option here, it'll kind of expand it. And then all you gotta do is uh, click on any of these tabs to basically activate or close them down. Uh, you can basically tab through each of these. And then you can minimize just by clicking on that. So there's these are all hidden paint, uh, panels in here too. Um, any of these panels you can drag out and have a floating window. So um, you can see here, I can rescale it, resize it however I want. I can collapse it into its smallest little tab here and then expand it. I can even bring it back and dock it a new location. Once you see a blue line there, you'll see uh, that it will be able to dock. So this one, if I click on this little rigid little widget here, I can drag it out and then bring it back over to this one until you see a blue line and voila. So, um, say you want to create your own custom workspace. Well, that's fairly easy to do. So say I grab several of these um, and collapse them just by closing them out. And uh, I want to save out this particular workspace. Uh, all you have to do is come up here and go down to new workspace, give it a, a unique name. So I could call it my workspace, for example, and click OK. And essentially, I would have that as an option here, uh, right up here at the top. So I can go back to the Essentials workspace. You'll see it here. And then I can click in here and go to my workspace. It's the one I just created. Any of the workspaces that you have modified, for example, the Essentials, I can go down to the Reset Essentials. So that'll bring it back to its default state. And then I can collapse any of these uh, panels that I like. So uh, even the tools here, they have a double arrow, so it expands and collapses. The main stage here is in the sort of center here. You have the ability to uh, slide back and forth with these little widgets here. So that's a basic overview of the workspace in Adobe InDesign CC. See you next time. Cheers.